Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. My name is Taylor, also known as Taylor with an E, and I am back for another adventure on Korea's beautiful Jeju Island. Summer is here, the weather is warm and beautiful, so we thought this would be the perfect time to fly back down to Jeju for the weekend and take a tour on Jeju's famous Ole Trail. Now, if you don't know what that is, it's basically a series of scenic walking trails that span the entire coast of Jeju Island. Now, there are 26 total routes that make up the entire Ole Trail, and you can choose to explore these routes on your own or select routes with an English-speaking trail guide through the Wander Jeju on Foot program, which is actually what we're about to do today. And after watching this video, if you guys are interested in learning more about the program or how to book a spa on the tour, you can check out this super useful video by Visit Jeju Global. So I'm about to head inside, meet up with Kendrick, meet up with our group, and we're gonna hit the trail. you guys we're matching outfits today oh no 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 come back <laughs> we wanted to match hiking outfits uh, so we were trying to you know do a little bit of the Korean style but I think we actually ended up looking more like golfers than hikers but you know it's okay <laughs> I think we still look good <laughs> So we are going to the start of our Ole Trail route, which is Route 10 today. We are already by the water and it makes me so happy. precarious situation so I'm now just filming the end of it because there was no way I was about to film trying to cross that rock path you guys oh my god ah! look at this cafe this is right at the bottom of this mountain everybody's here taking pictures because this is also right across from the water so this is a nice little stop on the trail if you ever want to take a rest and a break Oh my gosh, this cafe is beautiful. Whew, a little tired, but I feel good. I mean, it's a beautiful day outside. The scenery is amazing. So it just lifts my spirits, you know, even though it's, it is a little hot. But no, I feel good. I feel good right now. Some coconuts, some fresh juice, some water. Oh, I'll take a juice too. What to do? You can juice too. You can juice too. Oh, what's the challenge? Oh, it looks so good. Oh, I love this. This is so cool. And we're off again.
actually in one of the more urban parts of the route. So what I wasn't aware of, which I'm just now finding out, not all the Ole trails go through like the natural parts of Jeju. They also take you on scenic routes through different parts of the urban areas as well. It's still kind of cool because you're still seeing a lot of different parts of Jeju this way. It literally is like a walk in the door. So and you just get to see every single aspect of Jeju life here. Oh, wow. Oh my god. Right. Alright, so we just sat down for lunch. We're taking a little break from our hike around Route 10. And we're about to eat this Jeju specialty, which is a type of seafood noodle soup. Oh, it's up in my shot. But yeah, oh, I am starving. So the place we are at right now is actually really famous for their kalguksu or noodle soup. It's called Badang Kalguksu. And if you guys just take a look at this bowl right now, like literally, it is the ocean. All of this is all seafood and noodles and goodness. Yeah, so guys, you can buy this soup here for about 10,000 won. It's probably about $9 USD, and you actually get a lot of soup. So it's definitely worth the price, and we were saying how this is probably the freshest seafood we have had in Korea, and you can totally tell why this place is famous for their kalguksu. It's so good. Breathing hard. We're going uphill. Ain't nothing but a little climbing. <laughs> Walk up. See, <laughs> I'm just going uphill, you guys. That's why I'm breathing hard. Yet this one decides to make fun of me for it. But the views are absolutely amazing from up here. Yo, this route is views on views on views. That is literally what Route 10 is of the Oli Trail. Oh my gosh. That was the hardest part of this whole trail. There were a bunch of stairs coming up. That's why you kind of hear me out of breath. Oh my goodness. But now we're on our way down and I think this is where we are actually going to end our hike. We haven't even finished it, but because of time, we're kind of cutting it a little short today. But as you guys can see, oh my gosh, it is such a beautiful hike. And for someone like me and Kendrick who don't really hike all that often we're kind of inexperienced hikers it's actually kind of right up our alley you know there are some tough spots but it's nothing like you can't handle great workout though i mean oh my gosh i reach every type of activity goal today you guys we made it y'all we made it we made it through the mountain wow 
one, two, three. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Good. <laughs> okay, everyone. This is end of our hiking today. Woo! Wow. We did it! <laughs> so that brings us to the end of my first Ole Trail hike. I highly recommend it to anyone who comes out to Jeju. And Route 10 is a perfect route to start with just because you get everything. You get ocean, you get views, you get mountains, you get urban, just everything is included in the package. So again, if you guys are interested to learn more about the Wander on Jeju program, maybe you want to set up a tour yourself, please check out the video by Visit Jeju Global, which I will link above and in the description box below. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Have an amazing, wonderful day, and I will see you next time.